Hemic Beach again and it's the 7th of May. Um, it contrasts from last Monday when we were stripped off and paddling. <laughs> it is really cold. The winds, well it's not freezing but it's it's very windy. It's not been like this for a while. Um, but it's low tide and we managed to go further along because the beach opens up and you get all these little coves sort of quite far away although there's loads of rubbish and unfortunately we haven't got a, a bag with us today but we'll, we'll probably come back tomorrow and pick some stuff up um, but yeah it's uh, it's really nice to have a place to ourselves again and, um, and yeah just have a breather before we go home oh and yes this water <laughs> Uh, this is, I don't know, it's just coming off the field I suppose, isn't it, down yes. through the rock, right on the cliff edge. village we all have soakaways for um, for sewage and um, it sort of gradually seeps into the ground and probably heads down to the beach so we don't touch really any water that's coming from that direction sort of we have there's a stream that comes from the hillside joining the sea um, and we don't know really whether it's even safe to it probably isn't, it's probably really toxic. But, yeah. Shame, beautiful place. You might be able to see some of the, the coloured plastic everywhere. There's just tons of it. We arrived on the beach and thought, yeah, great, you know what we did last week, we picked up so much and there's not much there at all, but coming further along, you just find these waves. Uh, I imagine that it's mainly coming from the sea rather than coming from the beach. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it around. See you soon. Okay, bye. Bye.